This is an overview of the Merlin Library catalog. There are several ways to get to the book catalog. If you click the Books and Media tab from the library's homepage, you can enter your search here. This defaults to search the MU portion of the Merlin catalog. You can choose to search the Mobius libraries, which include most of the academic libraries in the state of Missouri. The search box lets you search by keyword, by title, or by author. If you'd like more advanced search options, click search and you will be redirected to the Merlin catalog. The quick search tab is the main search screen. In the upper right is the Merlin logo. Merlin is the name given to the catalog of the four UM Systems libraries. On the right there is a link to a Mobius search. Mobius is a statewide library network. Merlin is a part of Mobius. In the middle of the page are your search options. The page defaults to quick search, which allows you to do a keyword search, a title begins with, a journal, magazine, and newspaper title begins with, or an author search. The next page is the advanced search. This allows you to do keyword searches in specific fields and to tie them together with Boolean operators. It also allows you to add limits. Next is the subject search. These are searches by Library of Congress subject headings, medical subjects, or genre form terms. Subjects may not be very intuitive to library users as they are assigned by librarians. But if you can find the right subject, you find all the books in the library about that topic. Finally, there are numbers other searches. These are mostly used by librarians. When you run a search, you will be taken to a results page. In many databases, all types of searches bring the user to a results page full of titles. Merlin is a little different. If you search by title or keyword, you'll get a list of book titles. But if you search for an author, you'll get a list of authors. Similarly, if you search by subject, you'll get a list of subjects. Let's see an example of a results page. I'm going to search title begins with. I want to search the word platonic. I'm going to make sure my search looks at only the MU campus libraries. What I retrieved is a list of titles that begin with platonic. If I click the title of the book, I'll be taken to the book record where I can find the call number for locating the book. A search that brings up a different type of results page is an author search. Here I'm going to search last name, Clay, comma first name, D. Here I have a list of authors whose last name is Clay and whose first name starts with the letter D. If I scroll through, I see the person I want is named Diskin Clay. I'll click his name. There, I'll retrieve a list of books by title. If I want to, I can just stop and get the call number from here, or if I click, I can find out a little bit more about the book by going to the book record. The last type of search that we're going to review is a subject search. Here I'm going to search the Library of Congress subject headings. I'm going to put in platonic, like before, and search MU only. What I get is a list of subject headings. The first one I see says Platonic Academy of Florence, see Academia Platonica, Florence, Italy. That's a cross-reference. Then there are the titles of the subjects, Platonic Love, and so on, and a number of books attached to that subject. If I want to see those books, I merely click the subject heading and I'll get a list of those books, the title of the book, and the call number of the book. If I want more information, I can click the title of the book to go to the book record. This record page is a more complete description of the book. This page shows the author, title, publication information, and a description of the book. If you're trying to find the book in the library, you want to come up here. The location tells you first which campus library it is on. Next is the call number for the book. And finally, there is the status of the book. This book is not checked out. If it were checked out, it would say due date and show the date. Other status codes include in transit, which means it's being shipped between libraries, and lib use only, which means it's either a reference book or it's up in special collections. If the book is in Ellis Library, you can determine what floor it is on by clicking MU Ellis. A book location guide comes up. For this book, our call number B is between B and HE, so it would be on 3 East. If you click on the call number, you'll be put in a call number browse. The book you've searched will appear and all the books around it. It's like browsing the shelves without going to the shelves. This is useful if you're looking for multiple resources on a specific subject. If you don't want to find the book yourself, you can use the request button to request the book and library staff will retrieve it for you, though it may take a day or two. The record has two tabs. The first is location, which we are looking at, and the second is find similar items. 
What that does is pull the author, title, and subjects up so you can search them. If I search Disc and Clay, I will get all the books in the library written by him. If I click the subjects Plato Dialogues, I'll get all the books in the library with those subject headings. One of the strongest features of the catalog is the ability to search at other UM libraries and to request books from these libraries, or to do a Mobius search and search other libraries in the state of Missouri and request books from them. Watch the video requesting books to see how to do that. Thanks for watching, and if you need any help, come to the Checkout and Information Desk on the first floor of Ellis Library or contact us through our website.